All right, if you're here right now, I'm about to do a box break. It is this Infinite Forbidden set. My dad got me both of these for my birthday. Even though I'm not a big box breaker guy, here's what I did pull from the Ghost from the Past. I really only recognize this Malefic Cyber End Dragon here. But if you know any of these guys, you can let me know. Real quick with it. Yeah, I just really don't know a lot of these guys. However, I love the box artwork of the blue eyes, and I also do collect empty packs. So this empty Dark Magician Girl pack is pretty sick. Cyber and Dragon as well. Anyways, let's get right into this thing. See if I can open it up with, uh, with not too much force. I do want to see... If I pull anything related remotely to Exodia, because I'm a Dual Monsters guy myself, and uh, it's a shame a lot of the old monsters, I guess they're getting support, but not a lot of old cards. So not too many, except for the new reprint packs. Also here you can see I got all my strictly sealed card sleeves. I just love all the sleeves. I pretty much got all the colors I wanted. They're pretty sick. You should pick them up or think about picking them up. All right, I guess let's get right into it. Let's see. It's kind of thick. How many cards are in these packs? Got one. Two. I'm just gonna count them the first time. Three, four, five, six. Oh, is that the hollow? All right. Well, I got a super rare already. This guy, Barar, Balmonican Concord. What was that? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Oh, this guy got played on me at locals. This guy was messing me up. All those puppet monsters. Put all my hollows right there. So what, there's like nine cards in these packs? There's a whole bunch of these packs, let me tell you. I don't know how big, how many, 24 packs? It feels like way more. I might have to speed this up because this takes forever. And I'm not really going to save too many of these packs, so. Three, four. Okay, the hollow is the fifth one in. Dritron, Midianus, the Draconids. Pretty sick card. I mean, I don't know how much any of them are worth. I haven't checked the price guide yet. So I'm just hoping for Exodia stuff. Hell, I don't even know if there's hardly any Exodia stuff in here. So I don't know. We hope we pull something cool. That's for sure. I have seen some cool, uh, I don't know, their quarter century Exodias floating around at the locals that those guys will have. I'm going to try to, what is this, count it? Three, four, put it to the back. Five, maybe? Fifth one? Oh, I was right on that. Fifth one. Mimi Ghoul Dragon. Looks cool. He looks like a Toon character. Honestly, I think I kind of have not the greatest lighting all the way up here. I'm going to keep going. Uh, does anybody have a new favorite set that's been released that they can't get enough of? That would be... I would love to hear it. I'm going to be surprised if people actually watch this video. I'm not a big box break open video guy, but we will see how this goes. It's really just my birthday present I'm just deciding to open for everybody to enjoy. Corbico. Cool. And honestly, the way that they print all these rarities, I just feel like if it's not a secret rare, some awesome rarity that... It's almost like a super rare is kind of a
pop out because they print so many shiny holographic cards anyways so why so why only give me a super rare you know the rest are commons I don't know any of these guys I literally actually I have seen Cosmo Queen before but I think she was a McDonald's promo Dora 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 the Explorer okay that guy looks cool Oh, an ultra rare. Mimigul Dungeon. You can chain up all your little Toon Dragon guys. I don't know if anybody wants these packs, but it just takes effort to open them perfectly. And unless I'm specifically collecting. Oh, I didn't do the pack thing. Spell card, Soul Exchange. That artwork is pretty sick, to be honest with you. Even though my lighting is not good. It is a sick looking... Ooh, there we go. A hollow. Caught it. Hmm. What to talk about? Uh... If you're watching this video, have you watched my collection video? Because that thing has been blowing up. And Casual Yugi stuff even watched it. And, well, Strictly Sealed commented on it. So that's big. I thought that was sick. Okay. I know the, of this guy. Blazing Boardman Bombardment Beast. Whoa, Mimigul Master. Guy's cool. Looks kind of like a Summon Skull Baby King. Summon Skull Baby King. Um, I'm going to try to bring this down really quick. All right. Let's go with this. It's probably going to be better light, to be honest. you have a better way to open card packs let me know did you mention dang now that I'm looking at all these crazy names I don't know how youtubers actually read all of these names as they're going I'm gonna give it a shot next pack I'm gonna find out what are the missing borrows all right lighting is much better we only had to wait Eight minutes in to get better lighting. So if you stuck around this far, that's pretty awesome. Oh, if you're watching and you hear me right now, could you like this video? I will be surprised if it does get likes from this, but I'm just curious if people actually watch or if they skip around. I normally skip around, so I'm not going to hold it against you. Oh, I was going to read the names. Meteorora Drytron. Gimmick Puppet Rogue Doll. Gimmick Puppet. Gimmick Puppet Cattle Scream. Rusha of the White Forest. Cosmic Tree. Ermistil. Guardian of the Voiceless Voice. Dark End Evaporation Dragon. Rumi. And Susurus of the Sinful Spoils. Oh man, reading all these is a nightmare. And it. This cannot just be the only set where these names are crazy. Can't be. I'm just late to the party. I don't open a lot of stuff. Especially now that I'm older. I'm turning 28, by the way. So, big happy B-Day to me. Shout out. I'm headed to Charleston for my birthday. So, that's going to be pretty cool. Being Reflection of the Millennium. Fiendsmith Saint. Bed and Bad. Rusha of the White Forest, Madolchi, Mini Meow Caroons, Cosmic Tree and Mistil, Gimmick Puppet Little Soldiers, Night Arm Dragon, the Arm Knight Dragon. Who made that name? That is a tongue twister. Who did that? All right, same card as last time. Little Magician Women's. Dude, how long are box openings? Because 
I'm just going to tear through these at this point. All right. Later. I feel like if if I keep reading them all, this is going to take all night long for a video, which is not what I want. Since your eye on a tree, the artwork looks pretty sick, to be honest with you. Pretty sick. Moving along. I'm going to go Archfiend. Does anybody know if any of these are worth money? Because I'm about to look them all up way after. So far, I've got no Exodia pieces from the Infinite Forbidden. It's looking a lot less like it's infinitely forbidden and a lot more like it's a bunch of new meta stuff. But my dad, bless his heart, He's trying to give me some Exodia and Blue Eyes things for my birthday. I love him for it. Thanks, Dad. You're the best. Where'd we go? Now I'm just going to have this pile of common cards from new meta stuff that Yu-Gi-Oh! releases every couple, like every month, it seems like. What am I going to do? All these commons. Come on, Exodia. Uh, no, Ragnarika, Wicked Butterfly. Yes. All right, I'm running out of packs here. I don't know if I'm going to pull Exodia, but if I do, I will put him in one of my sleeves, whichever one I think he looks the best in. I have a good feeling about this pack. Whoa, gimmick puppet Fanta Six Machine X. I think this thing looks cool. Kind of like a Gundam or one of those Digimon from back when they used to morph into the player. Do you know what that's called? I do not. But I have action figures that are not Digimon. Well, that was not a uh, Exodia. So we'll keep going here. Come on, Exodia. Not even an arm. Not even a leg. Spell card Monster Reborn. That is actually pretty sick. All right. That's a sick artwork. We'll give him that. We'll give Konami the sick artwork. Approval. I do like responding to comments. I will say that. I don't really make YouTube videos very often, but it is fun to see what people have to say. And I respond to all the comments. So if you got something to say, hell, tell me something I could do better. But uh, don't be too harsh on me. Dark Magician. The Magician of Black Magic. Okay, well, I feel like this guy is probably something because Dark Magician is pretty sick. The armor is interesting. He's looking like a much buffer version of Dark Magician, which I can get on board with. I can get on board with it. Black and gold, pretty sick. Like if I was playing Super Smash Bros. and I was changing his armor, I would probably pick that to change his armor too. We will put him next to the black um, sleeves. Strictly sealed sleeves. That's cool. That's probably... That's a pull. And even if it's not worth money, it's a cool card. So it is a cool pull and somebody who I know. So it's, that's big. If you didn't know, my first card ever was a Wing Weaver from Pharaoh's Servant. That's set. So. Zapper Shrimp. 
Tales of the White Forest. I've been seeing a lot of White Forest stuff. And honestly, it kind of sounds like White Force. And I don't know how I feel about the naming there. I think somebody did it on purpose. It's weird. That's all I'm saying. Even though I don't know most of the people in these packs, I will say it is... It's less fun to open packs, but it's still kind of fun because at least you can expect a hollow pretty much every pack. Didn't used to be like that. I like this. I like this without the without the uh, shiny hollow name. It's cool. It actually makes it feel a little more premium to me. That's weird because it's like a throwback to just a normal super rare. They're all like that. Maybe I'm losing my mind. Maybe I can pull an Exodia. Cool. Maybe go Cerberus. Okay, I'm really thinking that they went for a Toon. Is this Toon support? What is this? No, it's not Toon support. But they look like Toon Monsters, which is sick. Okay, the Mimigul stuff, sick. I like it. I'm almost done here. I've got, what, three more packs left? But this video is massive. And I'm, I'm not editing this, so. If this doesn't get any views, then sucks to suck. That's okay. This is my birthday present. Mimical Dragon. I already got this guy, but he looks cool. And guess what? He looks just like that one Digimon. The red guy with... But had the cannons in his back. I don't know if anybody knows what I'm talking about. But if you're about 28 years old, then you might know what I'm talking about. Leave me a comment if you were born in the mid-90s. Mid to late. Dark Magic Mirror Force. The artwork is cool with Dark Magician and Blue Eyes. They have a couple different artworks they come out with these days. That'll have them. I think there might be a spell card called White Lightning Attack or something. And it's got Blue Eyes and Dark Magician on it. It looks sick. Am I going too slow? Might be. Whoa, Secret Rare. Diabelle, Queen of the White Forest. Okay. All right. Which sleeve? Which sleeve? Mm, I'm thinking either purple or white, or maybe even green, because she's looking plant-like. She's not a plant monster, though. But she's getting a green. I'm going to put her right here. We'll look her up later. She's an illusion synchro. I did not know that illusion was a was it type. That's cool. That was basically my second to last pack and probably the pull of the whole box. So thank you for seeing that with me. If you made it this far, you can pretty much leave because there's no way there's anything good in this last pack. Maybe there is. But probably not an Exodia. But I wish there was. Whoa. Okay, this guy is good. People have talked about this guy. I've seen this guy getting played at locals. This might be the pull of the box. I imagine he's worth something 
maybe ten dollars, maybe more, maybe twenty, maybe even thirty. Uh, if you made it all the way to the end, please leave a like. Please comment. You don't have to subscribe, but I will try to make a video maybe every week. Mostly older stuff though. So if you don't like older stuff, then you don't gotta subscribe. But I would love if you liked or commented and uh, just chat, chat me up. Anyways, thanks again for watching and I will see you later. Happy birthday to me. Bye.